Okay, we're gonna do the what I found for 2018 food products. I found a whole lot more than what I'm showing you here, but I ain't showing you everything because a lot of it was from, they haven't changed the packaging. Like Captain Crunch, for example, no package change. Looks just like it did last year and the year before. Many things just, it's like we'll just do the same thing we did before. We don't have to change the packages. I'm trying to show you a few things that I didn't have and that I think at least changed the packaging. And I'll try not to spit as I do it. Um, a lot of these are, the I fold them up because I keep them up. How do you, how do you say that? Funfetti? Funfetti, yeah. Okay, this is, Pillsbury always does a Funfetti Halloween cake, okay, and frosting, which I happen to make today. Why did I make it today? Because it's your birthday. It's actually my birthday, November 23rd, and I'm 60. I wasn't going to say it. I was uh, going to say I, 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 I've always think there was some discrepancy with that. Anyway, I made that today, and um, yeah, let's put it back here. Yeah, okay. <laughs> anyway, yeah, I'm 60 today, but I, I've argued with my mother about this over the years clear back 30 years ago I thought there was a discrepancy I think I'm 10 years younger than what my birth certificate says she somehow thinks that it was legitimate but I think it's been tampered with was I it, think I'm turning 50 today was it legitness? I don't think it was legitness I think it was <laughs> I think it's been tampered with now my wife she's really that old but I don't I don't think I'm this old I've been well, then how old am I oh that your age doesn't change you're still pretty darn old, but still. Dang it, I thought I was going to get away with it that time. Okay, this package, this is kind of debatable. I'll go up to you. You don't have to come to me. But this is Hawaii, King's Hawaiian, the buns. You know what I mean? If you want, you know, this, you guys eat these buns. Talk about it. You eat the buns. I like to eat Hawaiian buns. I don't. I put them in the microwave and warm them up, put a glob of butter on a plate and dip them in the butter. And this movie is called Halloween? Is that what? Yes. There's more on the back. Well, it's just about... Yeah, hollow, it's about... Okay. Oh, it's about anyway, Halloween in Hawaii. Yeah, and with these little creatures, again, I'm debating whether or not this is Halloween. It kind of is, kind of isn't. What are those things? I don't know. I mean, it's not really. If you see the trailer, if you go on YouTube and watch the trailer for Halloween, I mean, it is and it isn't. So I don't. I don't really know. But I got it anyway. Okay. So anyway, I didn't have this. Um, the monster kisses. Okay. I'm not showing you a lot of candy. I collect a lot of the candies too. I'm not showing you. Okay. I'm just not showing you because I got I got too many and and I'm showing you the. The Oreo uh, chocolate candy bar with the little bats on it. Okay, I'm showing you that because I don't. I've never showed that before, but it's old stuff, you know. As far as I'm concerned, this is the new, somewhat lackluster uh, Oreo. I mean, look at it. It's just, it really is just the best you could come up with. And I don't. I, I don't know about you guys, but. We've definitely noticed, but with Halloween, with Christmas, whatever. Sure, it tastes like a normal Oreo, but we've noticed that definitely the chocolate part is hard. You dunk it in milk, and it doesn't take to the milk in the same way that your regular Oreos do. It just it like doesn't penetrate as well. And I only you, eat the white Oreos, so I have no idea. Yeah, it just there is a difference. There should not be a difference. They all got molded designs on the front. It should be any different. But anyway, that's the new package. I'm not real thrilled with it. I don't get thrilled about these things. Here we go. We're back to, you can hold this with me here. We're back to the, the uh, Hotel, Hotel Transylvania. Transylvania. Yeah. Okay, this is uh, three of the labels off of um, Tombstone Pizza. They always do Halloween. I've showed you stuff in the past where they do Halloween, okay? And uh, we're back to Hotel Transylvania again. They, they, it's like, oh, this is Halloween because we're getting paid to, sh to do this. 
the monsters that they would put up there didn't pay him anything, but Hotel Transylvania, I'm sure, did. And it's like they kill two birds with one stone. They do Halloween. They get money at the same time. So we didn't get the standard creatures on um, Tombstone Pizza, so I was a little bummed. Again, we're, there, it was like a sellout thing. So I collected them. Show me something you're not bummed about. Show me something. I, I don't know. I don't have this. I didn't have this. I got this down to like the quick mart. Now see, I thought that was cool. I like they that. They were a little hot. Well, um, not that I, I didn't say I was going to eat them. <laughs> the Cheetos flaming Hot Bag of Bones. You know, the Cheetos I have showed you before in the years have the, the white cheddar. Well, this is flaming Hot, so it was, it was different too. So I had to grab this. I don't have that package. I do now, but I didn't have it then. But I don't know why they just don't make the uh bag of bones just plain old cheetos you know cheeto flavor they ever think of that just to make it cheeto flavor is there some reason they can't make bones and in, in with a cheat yeah I, I they they have to make it a different flavor it's like no just make cheetos i don't have this but I, this i think it's been out well i know it's been out the spooky frosted flake you can hold that can you frosted flakes uh i i don't like them what a shock. Well, you don't, here, here's the thing. You don't need chocolate frosted flakes, right, Patty? Right. Right, because you, you eat frosted flakes. I do not eat frosted flakes. Well, you don't need them chocolated, okay? Chocolate. And we got the, this is basically the same too, the Apple Jacks cereal box from 2018. Hardly no changes at all. They didn't do much with it, and the same with the, with the Fruit Loops, subtle changing, but not really anything to speak of. Kind of dull. Now this I grabbed. This is something I didn't have until this year. The, what is it called up front? Uh, the Reese's Puffs chocolate. Peanut, peanut butter, butter bats. Peanut butter bats. Now, I didn't have this box. I don't think they made that before this year, 2018. So this, this, case. Is, this is new. The, they taste uh, not overpoweringly peanut butter. They were okay if you like peanut butter cereal. I don't. But I ate them. I ate them and I... They were fine if that's what you're going for. I wasn't... I don't go for that. I didn't have these. I don't know if they did the pop... Poplets. The powdered donut intimates. I've always had the... the and I, and I did this year too. I had the, the donut balls, the glazed donut balls. But I never had had the 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 box with the powdered donuts before. Okay. And I got the I got the donut ball. I'm not showing you that because it's just redundant. And but I didn't have that one before. But so I got that one. And now we're down to the you hold that one up, the Indimates. And we're back to Hotel Transylvania again. And show show the back side. I was of that. gonna say, and then on the inside. That, that you, I guess you can color it or something. I don't know. We have several boxes of this and this and this. It's just Hotel Transylvania. It's just decorated before Halloween. So it's, if you want to call that, it's more just advertising Hotel Transylvania. So again, mm, you know, it's like the sellout thing. I don't know how much money they got to do this, but oh, you want this stuff? yeah, go ahead and slide that over. We'll, we'll wrap it up with another disappointment for the year. What? Oh no! I liked this. No, it, no. Yes. I mean, I like this last one. year they did nothing. Burger King had the black burger the year before, and then last year that like Halloween didn't exist. Okay, I like didn't the say design. A word, didn't do anything. Dropped the ball one hundred percent. Right on the ground. Okay, this year they come out with the Nightmare Burger. I'm sure a lot of you have seen the advertisements on okay, TV. Okay, well, I like this one, so shut your mouth. It was very <laughs> short-lived. Here's the crown. Actually, the crowns were there and gone before the Nightmare Burger even hit the store. Okay, it's like Frank got a couple sign. of crowns. Same with the, with the... Okay, we must discuss the cups. It's got pickles... And then zombie fingers. I'm hard, not quite hard, hard sure. Hard to distinguish. Yeah, I'm not two. quite sure what the concept was on that. But at our Burger King, it was the same thing. These things were there and gone. These things were there and gone 
before the Nightmare Burger even hit. Um, so I thought that was weird. This is the package of the Nightmare Burger that I saved. I did eat a Nightmare Burger. This is the package. I feel like it's like the Burbs painting, you know. It's like, yeah. I don't know which way to turn that. I don't know. Well, what crown. is that? I don't know. What even is that, Burger King? Seriously. Okay, Frankenstein. And it's like a bunch of different things all hooked together, like fabric wise. Duh. If you gotta, if you gotta sit there and figure it out, it's not a good idea. And then this had onion rings or fries in it. Fries. Uh, well, see, it's a fry pack that was never used. I, I just got that for. Yeah, I just asked the guy for yeah, that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so I did get the nightmare burger. It cost me with tax because we had to pay tax. We're not tax exempt. Seven forty-eight for a nightmare burger. It pretty, yeah, it was pretty big though, wasn't it? It was pretty big. A lot of their burgers chicken, are like seven. chicken, and chicken patty, and a burger. Okay, put together, you wouldn't think that would taste too good, but it really wasn't bad. But the thing was, it needed a more powerful sauce with it. It was very bland tasting. It just with the, with the, when they had the black burger. They had that, like a steak sauce on it, and you you could tell you were really, and it was good. But this, it just was bland. So I, I can't really say that was good. And although on the commercial and stuff, you see, when you see the burger, the, the bun was more of a vibrant right. Yeah, it definitely was not. But in real life, it was like baby poop green. <laughs> it was not a very appetizing color. And you'd say, well, black isn't a good color for you. It didn't really affect that in the same way. This had a more of a disgusting color to it. It wasn't it wasn't a good color. So the Burger King thing, they come back and they tried. They just didn't do a good I job. I like this. They design. messed up. No. She didn't eat the burger. She wouldn't eat the burger. I'm not She's talking about the burger. I'm talking about pickles and fingers. I still don't understand it. But if, if you got it again, it's back to that. If you, you got to kind of look around yeah. to see what's going on, I thought it was just pickles. And it's like, wait, that's got a fingernail on it. <coughs> so we're at Taco Bell. Get it? Fingernail? That thing you saw? Somebody found a. Did they really? Internet totally stuff. Totally just ruined my joke. <laughs> totally. I mean, internet stuff. You know, it's like, did they find it or not? Yeah, they probably lied. They're trying to get money. What a surprise, huh? Anyway, there we go. Burger King tried, but and I do want to mention one more thing. McDonald's. I didn't even bring out their product for this year because I didn't want to dignify it with putting it on the internet. I don't even remember what it was. They had their little containers with just lame. It's, it's like they were afraid they were going to use too much ink and they did everything real lame. It was terrible. No Happy Meal buckets. Nothing. They just, it's like we're not going to put any effort behind it because we don't care. Well, that's why you're not getting on the show either. McDonald's. We have all the fast food around here, all of them. McDonald's is by far the slowest. They always make me wait in line. They are just, they're, they're terrible. Whatever time it takes you at the worst place around here, it's gonna take you three times longer at McDonald's. It's terrible. Slowest in town, no question. Okay, that's what we found for this year. I got a whole container full of stuff, but you don't wanna see it. It's somewhat redundant, that's why, and or similar to the years before. Every, Okay, so I'm going to wrap it up. And he hates all of it. Yeah, okay, we're going to do one more show.